when I'm in the water, I feel very peaceful. I'm not thinking about nothing. It's just me and the water. When I was growing up, girls was not allowed to be in the swimming pool. When I first put on a swimsuit, the older black women told me that was embarrassing. I told them I was doing it for my health. I was 19 years old with two kids when I learned about my eyesight. I used to see a little bit, but now I don't see anything. I was 320 pounds. I had breathing problems. I had walking problems, and I had a heart murmur. All of that is gone now. The doctor told me I was going to die at 60 if I didn't lose the weight. My husband said, I'm going to take you to the California Pools of Hope. A coach took me to the deep water and told me to jump off the deck. I stood on the deck crying. He said, I told you I'm not going to let you drown. And I jumped in. I said, this is not too bad. <laughs> Since I started swimming, I have lost 116 pounds totally. I feel really good. I decided to swim competitively because I know how to motivate myself and I'm looking for results. I run the neighborhood centers for Humana. I swam in the 1984 Olympic Games and won two gold medals in the 100 meter backstroke and the 400 meter relay. I'll start with the fundamentals, but then you can go back to your swim instructor and have him work with you. The fact that Vivian was challenged with having diabetes, being overweight, but not really having any physical activities in her life and her physician challenging her that if she didn't change, the outcome was not gonna be good for her. She found a pool, found an instructor, and went from being a non-swimmer to swimming four days a week. Vivian exudes that every day about what's possible. My favorite stroke is the freestyle. I like the backstroke too, and I'm just learning the butterfly. What I find best about the senior games is it's not about winning. It's just about participation and being around other folks of your own age group. And at Humana, that's really what we want to help and help them promote so they can enjoy their years, both healthy, socially, and, and emotionally. I want my grandchildren to know what their grandmother is doing. And when they look at me, they say I can do it. <laughs>